when I had my little girl, I, I went to go see my doctor after I had her and he told me that my blood pressure was too high, that he wasn't gonna let me leave his office. He was gonna send me straight to the ER to bring it down. But walking from here to my car, to your car, he's like, there's a chance you're not even gonna make it to your car. That's how bad your high blood pressure, your blood pressure is right now. And so that, to me, he's like, you just had your little girl and now you, there's a chance that you might not even be here or be around for her. And that was when it clicked to me. When I started, okay, now I need to do something with with what's happening with me, with my body, with 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 my health, and that start that's what kicked off the journey. And I started therapy first because that is something that the doctor will look into, making sure that you know everything's okay mentally before you are ready to take on the surgery because it's it's a commitment, it's a big commitment. And it's not easy and it's not the easy way out. The first step is for a patient to reach out to us. And if the patient calls us and reaches out to us, then we will direct them towards an online seminar. So now there's so many different platforms. I actually give the presentation, it's like a PowerPoint presentation. And after that, if the patient is still interested, <clears throat> then we will reach out to them and start the process for an initial evaluation here at the hospital, which is on the first floor where our clinic is. And then we start the requirements to get to the weight loss surgery. With clinics on both the west and east side, we try to make it as convenient as possible for the patient to come in, meet the team, and answer any questions that you might have. Very supportive and positive, and that's what I loved about it. And if you have a question, even if it's an easy nutritional question that, you know, probably could be answered on Google, if you email them or reach out to them, they're, they will help you and they'll make you feel, they make you feel like a family. And I really liked that. I really liked that a lot. They still do. They still do. I was 273 at my highest, at my highest. And I've reached my goal of 150. And I just kind of go a few pounds um, under, a few pounds over. And that's, and that's perfectly fine. You know, the, the, I'm pretty tall. So I feel for my height, 150 is a pretty good uh, uh, stopping point. So I've lost 123 pounds. I feel more energetic, I feel like my old self and, and that was something that was missing for a long time. No more, no more on medication, no more issues with high blood pressure, no more sleep apnea, no more snoring is a big one too, like you don't go through all of that anymore, you don't have that big machine anymore. That's been awesome, that's, that's been amazing, like I said, I, I feel I feel as young as my children, they're 18 and 16. Hi, I'm Abril Watson, and if I can make the change, so can you.